Hello, Women's Empowerment. Thank you for tuning in with me on today. So today's topic is the adaption effect. Let's go straight into the word of prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, we just bless your holy name for what you're doing in our lives, Lord God. The women that you're touching, Lord God, lives through Women's Empowerment, we ask that you do something new and something different in us. Lord God, restore our relationship with you. Let it be more connected and be deeper, Lord God. Let us continue to fellowship with you, Lord God, in our alone time, Lord. We thank you. We give in the glory, the praise, and all the honor. In Jesus' name, amen. So... The reason why I chose this topic is sometimes in our lives, we tend to be adapted to our circumstances. And why I say that is because um, a couple weeks ago, I was in my closet, and that's where I do my worshiping and my studying. And while I was doing that, the closet light went a little dim, and I noticed it. But nothing triggered in me to say, let me try to fix the lighting or anything. So I continued to study. And as I continued to study, what ended up happening, the light dimness brightened back to its original state. And I was like, wow, that's bright. But while I was sitting there studying, as the light continued to stay dim, I got used to the the amount of lighting that I was getting. So when the original lighting returned back to its, to its original state, I was kind of like shocked because, you know, I was already used to the lighting. And God had brought something in my spirit and he stroked something in my spirit. And he wanted me to let you guys know on today that sometimes we uh, have our walks with God and sometimes we do things out of the ordinary that are something that we may not do and then because we continue to stay there or continue to do those things that we don't originally do we get used to it until God has to strike something in us to show us that you are letting your surroundings or whomever around you contaminate your spirit and letting them make you feel like whatever you're doing is okay so when the light is shined on that situation you're shocked and you're like i don't even know how, I, how i've gotten there but that's just how the effect of adaptation works that as we continue to stay in that state we continue to be adapting to that situation where it becomes our new normal and what i want you to do on today Whatever your circumstances in your life is going on, say, Lord, God, show me, shine the light on the darkness in my life out. Whatever situation that I have let be contaminated or whatever thing that that's happening in my life that is not pleasing in your sight, shine the light on it, Lord God, because I don't want to be adapting to whatever is not like you. So I just want to encourage you on today. Keep your head up, ladies. Keep continuing to walk. If, if something has happened in your life, don't give up. Don't throw in the towel. Continue to walk. Continue to have your head up and say, you know what, God? I know I made a mistake. I know I allowed certain things to happen in my life. I know I allowed certain people to come in at the wrong times and, and to make me take a few steps back. But, God, I'm willing to admit this, and I want to go forward, and I want to have this new direction and this new connecting this with you so i just want to thank you for tuning in with me on today and just stay encouraged you, you know ladies just continue to keep the faith continue to stay focused on what god is doing and god will shine that light upon your life and upon those situations and restore you back into your rightful place in him so i thank you for tuning in with me on today and i'll see you next week have a wonderful day